Hello everyone and good morning YouTube. It's a little later in the day than usual so hopefully there's not too many extra sounds. Hopefully you don't hear the neighbours over our heads thumping and clumping around up there. Um, just a quick video to show the route that I finished. Finished that one I started the other day. It's been a couple of days since the last video so fair enough. So we'll just take you over now um, and then after I've shown you that, I'm going to do a bit of a playthrough. So this is the this is the route. It's been finished. You can already see quite a bit of difference, I imagine. Um, the grass is very much, quite a bit different. A lot more lush. There's a gate. I've added. I've finished the decorations, the flowers, some more grass. The trees are different and you can see that the road comes down to where the farms are. I've also got the Lacrima lights installed rather than the post standard Pokemon lights. So I'm just going to come down now and straight away you can see yeah that the farms, the farms are here now. This was just a blank field before. So I've got farm number one which is mill tank and vegetables and a bit of grain there to make hay and then this side is the pl fruit plantation, the orchard um, and we've got a bit of a, bear a juicing factory happening here now these were actually, these trees these were made for a, a different game These were, I mean you can sort of see the new tile set here um, it was all made for a different game and I've just imported it over just to make it easier um, I kind of just wanted to get into it I didn't want to waste too much time remaking tile sets that I've technically already done I just sort of added some fruit so yeah, you've got berries and you've got grain cabbages, carrot, tomato I've got two, I've got picked and non-picked then yeah, um, some fruit trees I kind of like this, it's a bit ambiguous. It could be apples, it could be oranges. I like to think of those mangoes. I am Australian after all. So yeah, I just, um, I made all this for a, a different game. So I'm putting it to use here now for this. So yeah, and then come, so we've got those two farms, two farms here. And then the third farm is down here. This farm's a lot more self-contained. Um, grain to make hay, the orchard, a few more vegetables, carrots, tomato, cabbages, um, chives or onions or something, and some berries. So, yeah, it's now quite a busy, quite a full pathway. I'm really, really happy with how it's come together, actually. I did not expect it. Okay, now have a bit of fun, have a bit of a playthrough. Hopefully it won't be too loud for you. Save and off we go. Um, I'm already, excuse me, I'm already at this finish route because I had a bit of a walkthrough before. Um, I haven't set any of the layers and I haven't set any of the like what I can and can't walk through. I had don't think I have set my encounters yet. Um, I do all that right at the very end. I just want because it's easier to have a look through when you can walk over everything. You can access everything faster. Okay, so here we go. Um, just ignore this for the moment. I needed a graphic for my starter. Um, without one, it just completely crashed. I just haven't. I just made one very, 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 very quickly to put in so it would run. But there is a, that's that's definitely not going to stay. Definitely going to make a better one. All right then. So a bit of a a play. This will probably take a while because of the changes. And there's actually quite a lot of scripts on this now, with all this bell tank. All right. Let's have a bit of a look. Mm come up here first. Um, what you're seeing is 
this light, this lantern, there is actually a light source up here that you glows in the dark when it's night time, and that is throwing a shadow because it's obviously still morning at the moment. So that's what you're seeing there. I've already tested all the fighters while the train is down here. You can sort of see a little bit of glow, but um, that's fine. I'm not going to go in there. I don't need to battle them. I've already tested them all. Just a look. <laughs> These are the younger trainers. This is across to the gate. Right now, go and have a look at those farms. I'm going to cheat. This is why I don't set the um, what I can walk through and don't set layers and everything. Now I can have a bit of a look. Here we go. Hmm. These shadows are a bit dark. It's supposed to be translucent. Doesn't look like it's worked. Hmm. Doesn't look like it's worked, has it? Alright. Oh. Pixel error. Note. Okay. So, yeah. This is the. A lovely lady. Whoops, wrong button. Whoops, typo. I'm good at those. Hey bales. Hey mill tank. We'll come up, okay. Um, uh oh, it looks like we've got. I oh know, I'm good. A few little errors to fix, nothing major. The orchard. Yeah. Looking okay. Right then, we shall hurry along. I probably should have given myself running shoes. Oh, oh, I've lost the shadow. That shadow's incomplete. Oh, this is why we do a walkthrough before we're quite finished. Make sure everything's nice. And he was I saying was finished. Foolish, foolish Google shop. Okay. Let's have a bit of a round, look around the other routes now. Okay. Aha! One of my surprises. Let's show you. one. You can sort of see it running around. It's a bit small. Um, that shouldn't have happened. This map's supposed to be... oh well. <laughs> I love this! Okay, leave me alone! I love it! I think it's fantastic! when we insert the new graphic it'll fix itself anyway. Again, just another placeholder graphic. Our starter, however, our little Hellion, that's more or less what the standard of the graphics is going to be. So let's... 
Oh, this looks so sad. <laughs> Oops. Oh well. Let's just keep going for the moment. Just to show any, that everything's really working at the moment. Oh, this music's very loud in my ears. It's very distracting for me. So yeah, I can come in here and there's, there's more guinea guineas around. <laughs> I love it, absolutely love it. Okay, um, I'm going to come this way. I was, uh, I suppose I could have shown you Lakuma, but for the moment this is just a quick walk through. I'll show you a few of the surprises. Oh no! Um, why has that broken? Why has that broken? That's very strange. That is very strange. Very slow. No. 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 Oh, that's very odd. Oh, my poor computer is really, really slow. embarrassing. I probably should have checked all this before I... <sighs> Where is the map? That's really weird. Not you. Damn. Actually, that's probably how it broke. When I added the map, I must have moved things. That must have been how it broke. sort of see just how big some of these maps are. Um, they're just enormous and I'm only showing you a small fraction of what's going on. Damn. Okay. I can't be bothered making all of the interiors for the gatehouses so you just sort of climb in one end and pop out the other. <laughs> Lazy. I know. I'm sorry. Um, it's hard to get a sense of the scale, short of me spending an hour walking from one corner to corner to end to end. Another light. See, so these are the standard Pokemon lights, and I just copy pasted the code and used my own lights for Lacrima. Add some prestige. I think while I'm in um, Compass, I might stick my head into my with my mum and get my running shoes. This is very slow without them. Oh, 
There is a bit of lag, but it could be because of... Oh, useful. Mum's not here. Grr. Oh, that's because... I... <laughs> another guinea guineas. Here comes some fun part. <laughs> look, look! Zubat! Isn't that cool? Um, this map is done, but I've got my finger on the walkthrough button so that I'm not going to run into wild Pokemon while I'm here. But yeah, Zubat! I reckon that's fantastic. This is one of the surprises. Surprise! I absolutely love it. Um, yeah, so you can watch them all day. Have a great time. So, yeah, sorry, no running shoes. But, you can sort of just sit back and enjoy the view, I guess. That just means this video will be a little longer than I had anticipated or hoped. Nothing major. Giddinkins everywhere. You, you find them are all over the place. They're very friendly. As you saw, you can just walk up to them and pat them. <laughs> More milk tank. It's one of the carers' missions down there. That's okay. I'll take you through to the last sort of surprise. It's very laggy. I hope that's Cantasia that's the problem. Ooh. shouldn't be this laggy. Bit better. Mm. Another battle park. Oh, maybe I'll should have Pokemon okay. Um, after I've shown you this surprise, I'll come through and introduce you to Balthazar. I put Balthazar in this in this area. Big maps. Big big maps. Um I'm pretty sure I'm gonna let people have the bike pretty early as well, just to help speed things up through these long, long, long routes. Okay, here we come. Here we go. Look, this one's got Taylor. This one's got Taylor. Um, it, this one is not broken, it's supposed to be that way. The point is to investigate it. You get something special for investigating that. So yeah, and Taylor, these aren't quite as smooth as the um, Zubat. But little minor tweaks, they should be fine. Right, I'll go and introduce you to Balthazar. And then that'll probably be it for this video. I just wanted it to be a quick one. I'm going to turn my walkthrough on. Speed everything up. This is very strange. Um, they are, <laughs> I'm good, yes, they're, they're, fixing them is pending, they're going to be more guineas. Okay, here he is.
course he has a zoo bat. Anyone may think it was designed by Zark. Um, that's not going to work. Not ideal for this reason. But, oops, wrong button. Um, 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 um. Oh. Not much point trying to poison the poison type, hey? I suppose I technically don't have to win. You've sort of seen Balthazar now. You sort of had a bit of a look through around. And this music is very, very annoying for me. So let's just close that. Oh, peace and quiet. It's so lovely. How are we going for time? That should do it. Alright. I'm just going to wrap it up here. Um, I might do a more proper playthrough when I've checked everything and I've got the running shoes but that's essentially where things are at at the moment it's very very playable it's technically a functioning game now we've got three badges for the demo but you can you are able to acquire three badges I should say you can I just need to sort of patch up a few little things with the main story but it's playable it's doable um, once we finish the Pokedex, we'll be ready to release, pretty much. The Pokedex is just taking a long, long time. It's a lot of work. So, yeah. So, toodle pip, until next time.